the Easy Interactive tools allow you to use the interactive pen as a mouse and navigate around your computer, and also interact with projected content. When you open the Easy Interactive tools, the toolbar appears on the projected image, and an arrow icon appears on the other side of the image. Here you can see the toolbar on the right and the arrow icon on the left. You can switch the location of the toolbar from one side to the other by tapping the arrow icon. Now the toolbar appears on the left side and the arrow icon appears on the right. You can hide the toolbar if you want to by clicking the hide button at the bottom of the toolbar. When you do this, the toolbar disappears and we now see an arrow icon on both sides. We can tap one of those icons to bring our toolbar back up. There are two modes that you can choose from when using the tools, interactive or annotation mode and whiteboard mode. You can switch between these two modes using the icons at the very top of the toolbar. Right now we are using the interactive mode. In this mode, you can use the pen as a mouse and add annotations to presentations or other work displayed from your computer. The interactive tools in the top section of the toolbar include buttons for undoing and redoing operations, printing, saving, and more. In the bottom section, we find tools for annotating that include pen, highlight, and erase tools. Now let's switch over to whiteboard mode by clicking the icon at the top of the toolbar. We now see a blank white screen along with our toolbar. We can use this blank surface to draw, add images, and create pages. The top section of the toolbar includes tools for inserting images and shapes, undoing and redoing operations, and creating and saving pages. In the bottom section, we see the same annotation tools found in the interactive mode that include pen, highlight, and erase tools. In either mode, you can move the toolbar to any area of the displayed image. You can do this by tapping and dragging on the gray area of the toolbar and move it to a new location. To move the toolbar back to either side, you can just tap one of the arrow icons, and the toolbar moves to that side. 